this video, we're going to discuss renumbering and renaming of parcel area labels. This is important because you may create your parcels in an order that isn't what you want your final numbering to be. And what Civil 3D does is when you create a parcel, it takes the next available counter. What we're gonna go ahead and do is we're going to reorient that counter. So in order to do that, what you need to do is you need to select an area label from one of your parcels, uh, go ahead and go up to the contextual ribbon bar and select renumber rename. And then inside of this command, what you can do is you can either choose to renumber or choose to rename. In our instance, we're not gonna go ahead and rename them. We're gonna leave everything as property with a number. But if you wanted to rename it, you would go and select this option here. It would come up with a name template window where we would go ahead and type a name in and then select a counter number or a parcel number or an address, a site name, a style name, or a tax ID. And then we would go ahead and click OK and then run through renaming just like we're about to go do for renumbering. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do is I'm gonna choose renumber. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and click OK. And then I'm going to start my renumbering here at the first parcel. And I'm going to work my way around all of these smaller development parcels. And then I'm going to end in my roadway parcel, knowing that I have one more parcel left, but it will accept the final parcel number that's in the renumbering scheme. So I'm gonna go ahead and hit enter, and I will hit enter again. And as you'll see, all the numbers of the parcels have reoriented themselves in the order that I have clicked through them, with the last parcel being parcel 27, for the open space area.